What's up guys and welcome back to the city. We are back here in NBA 2K22 and uh, we've got a big decision ahead of us today. You guys know in the last episode we chose to approach the G League rather than throwing in early to the draft and that's coming with some interview opportunities. Do we want to go with uh, John Luck, a little bit more traditional, a little bit more focused on basketball? Or do we want to go with Andrew Torres who's a little bit more focused on lifestyle, flashiness, that sort of thing? Well, uh... We'll see what happens. But first and foremost, I do want to go into the tattoo parlor hey, here. Welcome in. Good to see you. Appreciate it. And uh, we are going to be getting our first set of ink here. You guys know over the years, I really like making a sleeve with like tattoos based on, on different parts of our life. And I feel like we need to commemorate the fact that we got second round, dude. It, it was it was not good. So I'm, I'm going to go in here. I'm going to go to premium. I was kind of browsing around. They've got some similar vibes, similar things that we've seen in recent years. I was thinking what we should do is get the roll of time here. So this is, uh, you know, obviously it's, it's representing that, that you know, limited time here on Earth. We got to take the, the chances, roll the dice, and, and you know, try our best to, to make things work for us. We ran out of time in the, the tournament, but we can, you know, still still make the most of what we've got left. So I'm thinking let's go with a, a left-handed sleeve to start things off. And to be honest, I'm kinda I'm kinda feeling that we're gonna put it down on the hands. We usually start how do I move him? We usually start up on the bicep and work down. I think this year we're gonna we're gonna mix things up. So we're gonna go roll of time. Let me go ahead and and make this maybe a little a little bit bigger. Maybe something something like like that. That's actually pretty sick right there. So we're gonna place that. Let's get inked. I'm also gonna put a number two on there again because of the second round. So we have different styles here. What do you guys think? What's gonna be a good two? Wish you could see the twos before you opened it up. These are all just really kind of outrageous. Ooh, there's there's a two that see that doesn't even look like a two, man. These are all ridiculous fonts. I don't know if I like them. This one's this one's a little bit more normal. Yeah, the two two right there. Okay, so we're we're gonna be able to add this. We're gonna place it on the left arm. We're gonna make it small. And I'm thinking this is this is kind of representing the second round. Let's put a little two in the clock right there. Beautiful. All right, get inked. It's as simple as that. I know in previous Hi. years, we'd have to go back in the back and you'd hear us complaining and stuff like that. But bam, look at that. We have a brand new tattoo on our hand. Obviously, doesn't really look all that great yet. But over time, we're going to add to it. And we're going to uh, to make it work for us. So it looks like the closest one here is about 60 meters. Should we, should we just let fate decide? I forget which one is where. I, I don't... What do you guys think? Is this going to be John Luck or is this going to be Andrew Torres? Going to be honest, I'm kind of hoping for Andrew Torres, the local news. I'm just going to let, I'm going to let fate take the wheel here. We're going to see. I, I'm going to assume this is John Luck because they say he's a little bit more traditional. I would expect he'd probably be in a... What's going on, MP? Nice to be here. <laughs> Yo, just thank you for agreeing to meet with me. This is exciting. No problem. It's not really what I wanted, but it's okay. Is not an easy guy to say no to, but I don't have a lot of time, so I'll just ask you a few questions, and then I'll write something up and introduce you to our readers. That sounds dope. All right, so now you're playing professional basketball. This has to be a dream come true for you. Uh, absolutely. I mean, ever since I was a kid, I've been the happiest with a ball in my hand, and, and now I get paid doing for it. Like, I get to get paid doing what I love. That's hey, You know what? I know exactly what you mean. You always dreamed about being a writer? I uh, know, um, astronaut, but uh, man, space is a tough racket. So what's been the biggest surprise during your time here with the Ignite Squad? Oh, okay. Biggest surprise. Gonna be honest, I don't like my teammates. Let's just keep it real. Guess, you know how well it's gone. I'm not saying it's been easy, but it wasn't 100% sure what to expect. Flash. And I think I've adjusted pretty well. I gotta say, you are not short of confidence. You know, I like to think I'm pretty good in my craft. So Solo yeah. player. All right, man. Great answer. Okay, last one. So you're looking into a crystal ball. Where are you 10 years from now? A lot of fans. Where are we 10 years from now? On a yacht with 10 rings? Or I can't worry. On a yacht, bro. Are you kidding me? Man, I see myself on a yacht. Tom Brady Somewhere status. in the Caribbean with 10 rings on my fingers, awards on the wall. You just, just the whole nine. <laughs> wait, wait, are, you, are you telling me that you're going to bring all your awards on the yacht with you? Oh, 100%. It's not like I got to pack them every time. You bring them once and they just stay there, man. It's my yacht, my boat, baby. All right, well, it looks like that's a lot of all fans I need. there. Thanks. Oh, that's it? 
Uh, all right, well, well, you're welcome. And if you ever have any questions or anything, just you know, let me know. Hey, play well, put up some points, win some games, and you'll give me something to write about. That sounds good. Thank you again, John. All right, take it easy, buddy. That's yep. the thing, John. We got to win games, but it ain't on, on your boy. Very obviously, super confident, outgoing, flashy, getting the job done solo-wise, but uh, the teammates are not, are not really stepping up and, and getting it done. We've got some new text messages. Chris Brickley. I won, by the way, I did win my second 3v3 game, so we've got uh, two more to go to be able to finish that. Ricky. Uh, cool. All right, appreciate the advice. Sounds going to be. So I think the next thing is just going to be to uh, to go and play our next game. I guess technically we don't even have to run all the way back to our, um, to our house. We're going to be able to play the main Celtics right here. Whew. Last regular season game. Hopefully we can get this done. So it wasn't my first choice of interview there. I think the lifestyle one could have been a little bit more fun. I do think that was the best case for our career. We have to be careful with some of our answers. You know, I mean, I definitely do envision myself with, you know, 10 rings on a yacht. Maybe one one ring and 10 yachts, but uh, I don't think we would admit that yet. We want to focus more on being a team player, especially if we're trying to improve our draft stock and stuff. So we're going to be careful with the media. It plays a pretty big role this year. Ooh, okay. Just going to gonna eye me like that, huh? I didn't think so. I don't think it's that big of a deal. You know, I, I think the biggest thing to be able to move forward in any part of our career, whether it be on the court, off the court, fashion, music, whatever, it's just to play well. We just need to make a name for ourselves and earn fans, which is ultimately what we did right there. I'm going to get penalized for helping on D right there. Maybe not. I see you. I see you. Way to finish. What up, Red? I'm about to have you feeling blue after I get done with you today. Oh, help switch. No, okay. Just don't help. That's cool. Whew, okay, he's got range. Here we go. You already know, baby. That's a tie ball game. I'm ready to come and help if you need it. Looks like we're playing some good D, and he makes the reverse. Bro, I, the AI is is tough in this game. Not not like from my perspective, from like guarding people and stuff. Get around that corner. Nope, he's open. Here we go. Given, give it right back. But I swear that the AI scores on my teammates all the time in this game, and I have no clue what to not get too crazy with it. Little pick and roll action. Nice. Love that extra speed. Just don't... Uh, why Why are you letting the big man just spin around? I, I swear, dude. They they melt through our teammates. Our teammates don't literally don't do anything in this game. It's so weird. Way to find me. I appreciate that at least. Holy cow. I, I just... It feels like I have to do everything on both ends of the ball. And I'm, I'm just... I, I can't. I'm not there. First of all, I'm not good enough. Second of all... Even if I was a 99 overall, I don't think I can make it happen. Ah, I wish we could have finished that. Okay. Gonna be going to the line. That thing snuck up really quickly. All right, here we go. Let's go two for two, Trev. There it is. Got to play some D for 11 seconds. 11 seconds. 11 seconds. 7 seconds. I'm going to try to come help. Ooh. Getting crafty with it. There it is. All right, one point lead at the end of the first. Got a C plus, 13 points. That's pretty good. So last game we had 19 points and, and we had a good first quarter like we did here. Then we started to fall apart. We got to make sure we stay consistent all the way through. It's like we're going to be running point starting off here. I like it. All right. I kind of want to start trying to run some plays. Receive screen. Come on now. Take that shot. Maybe not. Give it to me. The easiest thing is to just run these, these pick and rolls, baby. Probably could have dished that off, but we'll take it ourselves. Back to MP. Yo, a little floater there. We'll take it. Made me a little bit nervous. I was hoping to kind of lean a little bit in towards the basket, use the board, but looks good to me as long as it drops and the points get put up on the scoreboard. Dude, we've got 17 already. Get through, get through. Be careful. Big man's wide open down low. I'm going to try to get in there. That was a bad foul. I don't know where our defense is at. I don't know where our teammates are at. Just leaving him wide open, but uh, yep, that's going to be a three-point play, and they're going to tie this ball game up. Not much to work with there. 
Clock at four. Good plays, my guys. I'm, I'm really liking that. Just a give and go. Those are working out really well for us. You don't have to set anything up. You just kind of just kind of run it. Again, where's where's the defense, dude? I gotta do everything. I, I don't know I don't know what to say. Why are we taking shots like that? You see why I'm frustrated? What are my teammates doing here? I have to double team to, to make sure guys don't have open lanes to the basket. They're just straight up throwing the ball up in the air, just hoping, praying it goes in. Unreal, dude. I haven't sat down this whole this whole half. Haven't sat down once. Look at this. They're double teaming me because I'm out here literally doing everything. And we're still losing the basketball game. I'm just going to keep doing what I can do. I, I, I don't, we got 21 points in the first half. I, I'm taking this game over and we, we still... We still can't get anything done. I got your help. There it is. Give me the ball. Give me the ball. Say it ain't so. Dude, our stamina is going to be torched. Our stamina is nowhere to be seen because we haven't sat down yet. Holy cow, we're still not coming out. Whatever. I, I welcome it. My goodness. Dude, we are fighting for every point. Let's go. Dang it. Good block, good block, good block. All right, we're finally going to sit down. We were down by one. We're going to come back. At the half, we're up by four. Okay, team's actually actually getting something done. We're 91% from the floor, dude. 24 points, two assists, one rebound. A lot of it's just been layups. Pick and rolls, fast breaks, that sort of thing. Let's, let's just keep that up. Take smart shots. Do your thing. Don't let him make that. What? <laughs> Holy cow, how many picks are they going to set on me? Let's go. Little pick and roll. Didn't see much of a roll. Oh. Had the box out there, able to make sure our, our boy gets the rebound. Not really that, that tall down there amongst the trees. I'm not going to be able to pull down too many rebounds myself, but as long as somebody gets it, that's what matters. Get through. We're good. Let's go, dude. Good defense. Your boy is kind of all over the place. I'm not going to lie. Here, here, here. Uh, a three ball right there would have been absolute lights out. So hype. So we sat down. We're going to come back in up by five with five minutes left here in the fourth. One quarter left to play. Driving dish, baby. Uh, you should have cut to the basket. Okay, he's still got it. Here we go. Four four minutes. Just get a couple stops. If we could get like one to two stops, we're going to be in such a good spot. What kind of defense are you playing, 19? I, I just don't I just don't know. For the life of me, I just don't know. He's open. Let's go, AI. I don't miss that. Y'all want to make a basket? Sure. Okay, that's cool. Oh my goodness. Oh. Okay. Uh, <laughs> long as it goes in. Dude, they're double teaming me so hard. It's it's making it easy. The thing is, is they're, they're making every shot, every trip down the floor too. Luckily, he took a three there. He should have drove. I might vomit. I might vomit. Cut, 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 cut. Hit me. Oh my goodness. Okay, we're up by five still. Let's go, boys. Come on now. Two minutes. We just got to play good D for two minutes. Just try to slow him down. We honestly probably need to start slowing down our offense a little bit. Start eating up some of the clock. I'm trying to help with some D. That, sh that should be a rebound. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Got him. Oh, my God. Give me the ball back. No, don't put it back up, dude. We need time. We need time. Okay, as long as you score, that's what matters. Oh, my goodness, dude. Our, our shortest guy down there just throwing it up amongst the tree. All right, we're good. We're good. Give me this ball. Slow it down. Slow it down. Slow it down. This is going to be a win for us, dude. We haven't won since our, our 
very first game. It feels it feels good. Little pick and roll. There's the roll. Count them. So we had a, a really good start to the game. Had a kind of okay middle game. Really good into the game. 52 seconds here. Couple more possessions. They're gonna start fouling and stuff. I would imagine. Your boy makes his free throws. Here we go. Give me, give me the ball. Just gonna slow it down. Just gonna stay here in the corner. Keep attacking. Keep going back and forth. I mean, one more score is gonna be important to us here. We need one more. Shot clock at six. Little pick and roll action. Okay, that is a. That is about the worst case scenario for us right there. Did he have his feet set? I feel like his feet weren't set. Okay, we need to stop. They're gonna call a timeout. Oh my God, dude. Time to put up. Do not let them score a three or anything here. To the right side. Oh my God, it's our guy too. Let's go. Give me the ball. Nah, you gotta give me the ball, man. I would've make these. Give me the ball. MVP, baby. MVP. MVP. Whew. Your boy's got the hot hand. Give me 34. 21 seconds left. They're going to try to rush this down the court. They're going to try to throw up a three as quick as possible. They're not going to make it. Give me the ball. Oh, we're good. I was going to go for a three, but I'm not going to take it if we're not open. Bam, there it is. Able to get a win, dude. We had to try so hard for that. But we ended up with a nice stat line, and I'll, I'll take it, baby. Okay. That's going to take us out of the regular season of the uh, of the G League. We're going to be moving into the playoffs. We've got three games. Two to lead us to the championship. Draft stock's going up. All day.